Aunt Chip today. I got chipped today and it freaking hurts. Oh my gosh, my hand's a key. Are you kidding me? Amber, look, my hand's a key. This is an RFID chip. I have it implanted into my hand. The chip inside of my hand can open cabinets and doors. This does not work. Here is my ring. This does not work. Here's motion. Does not work. Here is my hand with nothing on it. Nothing on my sleeve. Here is the chip. Get chip today. Shalom. Call Halam La Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai by Hashem, Harakha Akodash. Double honor to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone that taught us this truth and sincerity. They steered us well and they rule well. Salutations to the hopeful elect. May the blessing of election be upon your house. This is Brother Zion Amawan coming at you with a quick hitter to feed the lambs through the Holy Spirit. Lord willing, this lesson is edifying and to the point. All right. This lesson is just going to be like what's on this video. Don't take the CHIP, man. All right? Don't take the CHIP. We Come on, man. The truth is out there. We've been saying it. We've been showing you. We we just been, been, been. Okay? So if you can't take it and if you can't handle how I'm teaching, if you can't, if, if, if you just a soft-ass nigga, piss off. This is only for the hopeful elect, man. All right? Lord willing. All right. So as you can see, you see a dumbass motherfucking Edomite couple. Woo. We're some dumbass Edomites. Yeah. We got chip. Woo. Yeah. You know, having a good old time, right? Yeah. It's all good now, but the Lord going to kill your ass, man. Okay. The Lord ain't, ain't dealing with that. They already got the MOTB right now, man. Let's watch it again. I got chipped today. In a nice little Tesla or whatever the fuck it is with white seats and woo, I'm a dumb Edomite bitch. That's entitled. Woo. Yeah, all of y'all Edomites, take the chip. I'm I'm gonna tell you to. Esau, take it. Do it. Do what you need to do, Esau. Okay? We telling our people not to take it, but you can do it all you want to. Cause the Lord finna kill you anyway. You already stubble. It freaking hurts. Oh my gosh, my hands are key. Are you kidding me? Oh my god, I'm a dumbass white nigga. Oh my god, I'm a dumb white bitch. Oh yeah. Ah. Fucking idiots, man. And Jake finna follow after these motherfuckers too. Because you love your oppressor. Look at this shit. He can't even smile. He looks so evil. Amber, look, my hand's a key. Look, Amber, I'm a dumb bitch. You see what I'm saying? Come on, man. The, don't take the CHIP. This is an RFID chip. I have it implanted into my hand. The chip inside of my hand can open cabinet. Right, the karagma. The mark is the charigma. The proper way to say it is charigma. Okay. But brothers ain't finna say all that. So it's karagma, which means a mark and imprinted stamp. Okay? And we can go get Exodus 21 and 6 too. You know what I'm saying? For that all. All right? That's in the law. Because that's that's basically you are stamping yourself for destruction. I don't know how many times we got to tell y'all this. But you're going to get hit with a missile. Okay? I'm, I'm trying to tell you. And the Lord's spirit going to be in the missiles, too. And he going to slow down time and cook your ass. So you better not take it. Indoors. This does not work. Here is my ring. 
this does not work. Here's motion. Does not work. Here's my hand with nothing on it. Nothing on my sleeve. Here's the chip. I can't stand these damn white motherfuckers, man. They just some fucking devils. I hate looking at them. Let's just go ahead and just do this, man. You know, so we can just go ahead and just get off into some more studies. But we got a revelation, chapter 13 and 16, a classic. We all should say it at the same time. And he calls of all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a mark, which is the haregma, in their right hand or in their foreheads, and that no man might buy or sell, save he that had the mark or the name of the beast or the number of his name, man. Okay? So we all know that the mark, the MOTB is in fact physical. It is not spiritual. Okay. And a lot of y'all niggas gonna be clocking in too, man. Let's let's, let's let's go back. Revelation 13 and 16. And he calls of all both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond to receive a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads. It don't matter if you got it in your ass cheek. At the end of the day, if you got the MOTB, you got the MOTB and you can't pop it out your damn skin and be like, well, I changed my mind. I don't want the mark no more. No. Once you make that decision, that's it. Ain't no more. And that no man might buy or sell. You see, I can get the mark if I got a job. No, nope, because you selling yourself. You are selling your labor. So you can't work. You can't do nothing with that. So don't think it's only for business owners and niggas with money. Because obviously them motherfuckers on that video got some paper. So it's going to be for the broke niggas too. And, and look. They already signed the CHIPS law, the little CHIPS Act, for the mass production of this fucking thing. And guess what? Guess who's going to be in there making that shit, Jake? You're going to have a Jake Eve with a long-ass motherfucking um, weave with the damn fake-ass baby hair doing the little swoop shit with some damn Air Maxes on and some leggings with a damn North Face on with some long-ass nails making a chip. That's what Jake Eve and Jake gonna be doing. They gonna have Jake make the shit. Take your ass down there to that damn chip plant on, on, on down now. Get your ass down there at the damn chip plant. They could, you know what I'm saying? They pay $55 an hour. Go down there to the chip plant and get you a job. You gonna have an old ass Jake saying that shit. I wouldn't be surprised if they taking applications right motherfucking now. But if you take that chip, your ass is grass. Revelation 14 and verse 9. And the third angel followed them, saying with a loud voice, If any man worship the beast, which is NATO in the EU, and his image, which is the revised Roman Empire that we're currently living under, and receive his mark, which is his karagma, which is that in which is that imprinted mark. OK, in in his forehead, which is that neural link or in his hand, hand. It didn't specify what hand. It don't matter. You can have it in your kneecap. At the end of the day, you got the mark. The same shall drink of the wine of the wrath of Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai, which is poured out without mixture into a cup of his indignation, which is righteous anger. And he shall be tormented with what? Ding, ding, ding. Listen, good. Fire and brimstone, them ICBM missiles, man. In the presence of the holy angels and in the presence of the Lamb, Yahawashai. Woo, 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 woo. Man, so if I was you, I wouldn't take it. I'm just going to let you know that right now. I mean, your ass is grass, bro. I got Exodus chapter 21 and verse 6. Then his master shall bring him unto the judges. He shall also bring him to the door. Woo! Woo! Or unto the doorpost. Woo! And his master shall bore his ear through with an awl. And he shall serve him forever. Woo! Woo! You ain't, you ain't nothing like a cow, nigga. 
You ain't nothing like a cow. And it's going to be a lot of you jakes that don't want to leave your master. So, so y'all want to get bored like, 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 like the cow you is, like the heifer you is. I don't want to leave massa. Well, come get this all, nigga. And a lot of y'all, y'all going to be in, I'm talking about y'all going to be in the lines by the families getting that shit. Because, because you want to fix noodles for these badass kids. So these niggas can still have snacks in the house because these niggas don't know how to go without because you always got to keep snacks in the motherfucking house. Fuck a snack. A lot of y'all going to take that all, that that karagma for them baby kids, them badass, nappy-headed ass baby kids, them monsters that you say that's a good kid, but they bad than a motherfucker. He just play too much. No, he bad as fuck. And a lot of y'all going to take that karagma and y'all going to get hit with liquid magma. That's going to be the name of this lesson. Karagma or liquid magma. You fucking pick. The Lord ain't dealing with niggas that take this mark. I'm trying to. I don't know how we can explain this more in depth. But bro, if you can't get it in these few few scriptures or these uh, prophecies, I don't know what to tell you. And Yahweh Shah going to come back around the time that the chip get implemented on a, on, you know what I'm saying, on a uh, mass mandate globally. That's when Yahweh Shah come. Yahweh Shah never finna let Esau chip the whole world. He finna put a monkey wrench in that shit. Revelation chapter 20 and verse 4. And I saw thrones and they sat upon them and judgment was given unto them. Who? And I saw the souls of them that were beheaded for the witness of Yahweh so all of the prophets, and for the words of, of Yahweh Shemahawashah, and which had not worshipped the beast, and neither his image, neither had received his mark, which is karagma, on their foreheads or in their hands. Hands, hands, it don't matter what hand. And they lived and reigned with Hamashiach a thousand years. Okay? So, hey, I'm just going to tell you this. I'm not taking that shit. So it's off with my fucking head then if that's my lot. Well, let it be off with my fucking head then. Because I'm not taking that shit. I'm trying to rule. Lord willing, that's in my lot. Lord willing, it's in your lot. You know? But if you take that mark, that's your ass, man. I'm trying to tell you, like, Yahweh Shai, you better, you better take that on the damn neck like a G. You better take that blade on the neck like a G, man. You know? Yahweh Shai laid down his life for us. And Yahweh Shai not delivering no bitch-ass niggas either. We got to endure hardness like a soldier. Last time I checked, basic training whoop niggas asses. Basic training make you want to quit. You better understand what truth you in. You better understand what your ass signed up for. You better understand what our forefathers signed up for, nigga. For you be in the hallway with your ass out. I'm trying. I keep telling y'all that, man. You know? So don't take the karagma or you gonna get liquid magma. If you if you take the karagma, you gonna get liquid magma. Lord willing, this lesson is edifying and to the point I want to give the glory, honor, and praise to Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Bahasham, Haracha Aquadash for giving me the spirit to do this lesson. Double honor to the apostles and elders, a great millstone that taught us this truth and sincerity. They steered us well. And they rule well. Salutations to the hopeful elect. May the blessing of election be upon your house. We on the next one. Abaratazah. Shalom.